Hello, welcome to Blue Harvest Toys. I'm just another quick video today. I have just got back from the charity shops. I am going to do a rant live stream on the charity shops, but I'm going to show you what I did get today. Yeah, I'm, I am quite livid on the prices, but there's a couple of other things I'm going to show you as well that have fair. Uh, Got through the post. So we've got another, apart from the scratch card, <laughs> past two of these scratch cards have £150 on. So, yeah, well, well, well I'll tell you if, if I win now, I'll let you know. So, right, um, I got the Alan Moore Swamp Thing Book 2 for £3.50. Um, this was, ironically, the cheapest. There was about three or four comic books in there, and this was. Ironically, the cheapest one, which is worth the most money. There was a couple in there, like the Penny Dreadful and um, Lock and Key, that I would have liked to get. There was a couple more books in there. They were just ridiculous prices, and actually more than you can get for brand new. But that's the three fifty I have got, and that's gone on eBay. That's certainly gone on eBay. Uh, they're going for about between fifteen twenty pound, if, if not more. So I put that on. Um, I did pick up a, uh, a Doctor Who jigsaw for one pound fifty. Um, probably put this on eBay, but uh, I got it for Amy, obviously. <laughs> so there we go, a nice little jigsaw there. Um, I did pick up some little dishes, some little dishes, which I'm not going to show you. Some some shorts and uh, this little pack of uh, Skylanders. I think the Skylanders. Uh, it's uh, this Boba Fett, these Ahsoka, these Ray. There's, I think there's a couple of Anakin's in there. There's Finn, and somewhere in there, somewhere in there. If, you can, if I can find him, oh, I can't find him. But is it? Oh, there he is. Look, it's Samuel Jackson. <laughs> so yeah, that was seven pounds for those lot. I think I can make a bit of a profit on that. So, but uh, this is what came through the post, which I really want to show you, which I'm really excited about. So we do have a 80% wicket graded. Very nice. Very nice. Uh, these will be going in the cabinet. Uh, I'm just trying to see if these sell in the cabinet. I might be picking up a few more. Graded loose figures is not something I uh, I usually go down, but uh, for the price of them, I thought I'd get them and try them. Plus, we have a lovely 85% T ball. So yes, they are, they're Ewoks, they're Ewoks. But um, I was just going to get that one, but I thought I might as well get both. I've got some graded Ewoks. Uh, 85, you can't get much better than that. Well, you can, you can get 90, 95, but any, I don't think I'll be getting anything less than an 80 because there's no point. But uh, you can see, you can't really see, so there we go. All 85s and the wicket at 80. So those will be going in the cabinet. If anybody's interested, let me know. So that's it. That's it for today. Um, as I say, random upcoming. Hope you enjoy that. Um, do I have a bag of figures for Mr. Paul? Already, there's one more he needs, and I can send that to him. Um, I will. I will find figures for you if you if you're wanting figures. Um, I will find them for you. I've always done that, and always will do that. But uh, I'll check check out my eBay. Um, check out my cabinet. Here in Marley Antique Centre, and um, subscribe, please. Thumb up the video, subscribe, and um, I will see you all next time. Thank you for watching. I'm in the toys. Be with you.